God has enough for your problem. He can take care of this. In Jesus' name. Now we are corporately in prayer. We need unification, uniting, united in prayer. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. In Jesus' name.
released in the spirit. Hallelujah. Tell the partner, I'm releasing atoms. Come on. One atom joins another atom. You form a molecule. Come on. There's electrons. There's power. Tell the partner, we're releasing power. Shout it out. We're releasing power. 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 Change the slide, please. Power. Shout it out. Power. 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 Shout it out. Power. Now, when the priest ministers before the Lord, they do not just come in in the presence of the Lord like we do. Okay, we hold hands like this and we move. The Bible says they move forward and backward. Forward and backward. They lead up the, the, the offer up sacrifices. Upward, forward and backward. They sort of pace around in the sanctuary. That's what the Bible says. And the Bible also says when they lit up the menorah, when they offer the friend's bread, and when they lit up the incense, they move forward and upward, forward and backward. Tell your partner, forward and backward, forward and backward, forward and backward. That is why so many prayer warriors are losing power. They sit still. They stand still. They never move. You go with the anointing. You move with the anointing. Whenever the anointing flows, you flow. Whenever the anointing is in the room, make excess of it. Don't just sit. Clap your hands and receive in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Now we are going to break for self-deliverance. Remember, the words that you are going to come out from your mouth are atoms. Tell your partner, atoms. Atoms. My atoms. Spiritual atoms. We'll join with the atoms. Come on, come on. Right, and God's atom creates supernatural power. We are going to form molecules this morning. Come on, somebody, spiritual molecules. Water level molecules. Fire level molecules. In the name of Jesus. Now, next slide, next slide, come on. Go with the flow. I'm stuck in here. Right, these are the prayer. These are the prayer. These are the spiritual atomic prayers. Hallelujah. I won't pray one, two, three, let's go three. Now you pray to yourself. Hallelujah. You gotta shout out from all, all your lungs, all your ears in your lungs. Get it out. Amen. Are you here for change? Amen. Are you here for change? Amen. Are you here for breakthrough? Amen. Are you here for breakthrough? Amen. I cannot hear you. Amen. Now shout it out and pray those prayers according to your pace. Come on. Come on, 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 you can go in your own pace, you can go up again, stay, come on. Shut it out, don't follow your partner. Just replay. Release those faith. Faith is like a molecule inside the atom. Hallelujah. Self-deliverance. Self-deliverance. You're gonna be delivered today. Self-deliverance. This is prayer for self-deliverance. Believe that you have been delivered. Yes. Believe. Believe. Here, yeah, lift up the realm of prayer. Lift up. You can go up. Pray for the other. Point two. Take your time. Release. Release. Touch and agree. 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 
touch her only. Self deliverance, self deliverance. It's happening. Power, 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 power. Something is happening here. Power, 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 power. Come on! Come on! Yes, come on! Jesus!
move, just move. Right, come on. Just do right. Oh. failure, sickness, fear, infirmity, rejection. We have broken that in the name of Jesus. What just happened? You released those power from your mouth. They came out from your mouth. Power came out from your mouth. Tell your partner, power came out from my mouth. Power came out from my mouth. The breath of God came out from my mouth. And declare in the spirit that I am being delivered. I am being set free. My breakthrough is just up yonder. Yes, come Monday, come Monday. I am declaring Monday, come, come quickly now. I don't care what the devil has done in the past. I don't care what the devil is a liar. He has done in this morning. Maybe he has stolen your money, stolen your property. He wants to steal your child. But I have news, I have news. Jesus is still king and he's still Lord. He out all demons of hell in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. Now tell to that somebody, I am walking in power. I know who I am. Now tell that somebody and just move around. Say three, three. Just go prophesy to three. Three, three, three person, three person, three person in here. Okay, I'm walking in power and I know who I am. I'm walking in power and I know who I am. Oh, 
share with someone closest to you. You know you need to share this message. He said, my friend, I am walking in favor. Just find one. I'm walking in favor. How about you? I'm walking in favor. Favor what? Shout it to yourself and say, I am a miracle. Ah, oh, yes, I'm a miracle. I'm walking in favor. And I'm a miracle. I'm a miracle. I'm a miracle. Come on, somebody. I'm a miracle. Shout it out. I am a miracle. And the world needs me. Come on, shout out. The world needs me. Sugar needs me. Fiji needs me. My Matangali needs me. Society needs me. My workplace needs me because I am working in favor. I'm working in favor. Yeah. 
comprehension. Like nothing ever seen on earth. Who can grasp your infinite wisdom? Who can fathom the depth of your love? My Lord, you are beautiful. You are beautiful beyond descriptions.
Thank you for visiting us. Thank you for the indwelling of your Holy Spirit. And never ever before in our lives we experience you, Father. We are not taking for granted this season. This is a season where you release the prophetic to your people. And let the prophetic season dwell in rest upon us, in our bosom, so that we may understand you and know you more. Thank you, Jesus. This is our prayer. In Jesus' one prayer we pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much. You may be seated. Again, it's uh, an honor just to be back in the presence this morning. I believe uh, after a week of uh, being away from Honolulu to, to Honolulu, and we thank God we, we send the regards and the best wishes and their prayers are with us and all of the families here in Suba and also those who are with us, uh, watching with us this morning, connecting with us from Fiji and also from uh, our international friends who are always uh, with us. They send your love, your message, your private messages. We also thank you for being with us all the way until now, until today. Amen. Um, I'm still on the scripture in which Luke chapter 10, in which God spoke to us on the way back about two weeks ago in Lotoka, and I'll just continue from there. And I wish to add on Genesis chapter 3 before I jump in Luke chapter 10. This was the scripture in which God gave while uh, I was in the 24-7 house of prayer in Duncan White Village, where the teams were worshiping and praying day and night. God just told me to look at Genesis chapter 3, and I believe and I also hope that you will be blessed this morning. You will take your portion with you, and you'll know that God has spoken to you this morning, amen, and will also release you from Mondays and to your Tuesdays, and Wednesdays and your Thursdays, until Sunday next week, you will come all firing with those atomic prayers. Amen. Tell your partner atomic prayers. Okay, I'll send this uh, deliverance prayer. I'll get it to Chris and then he will send it out to you in your emails so that you know and you continue to pray for self-deliverance. Now, let's read out together. Verse seven, two, three. Okay, again, again, two, three. And the eyes of them were open, and they knew that they were naked, and they saw the beginning together, and they made themselves safe. Okay, let's read it again for the last time. Now, remember, that is the word of God. Hallelujah. That is, come on, read it again. Two, three. And the eyes of them Now this is how God spoke to me, and I'll share it with you. The first, can I say part or body part, that felt, that experienced the first birthing of sin on earth are the pair of your eyes. You remember the five physical gates, the five gates? Out of all of them, something happened. They witnessed a rebirth. Something birthed out from the normal and the current environment they were in. Eyes. Eyes. Their eyes were opened. And if you click on the number, both of them will open. Okay, you come to the root word 6491. The root word in there simply means there's a dividing part from the unseen to the seen. 
Why is it that the, both of the eyes were open? Eyes first, eyes first. Because eyes in Hebrew, for them, it is a fountain of living water. Turn to your partner, fountain of living water. Now turn to your partner and look both in the eye. Come on. What do you see? People on the ground, they just see a beautiful face. Or a cani cani face, or a cani cani eye. Whatever eye you call it. Straight, yellow, stretched. Okay, blink, blue. You name it. But according to the Hebrew, that is the fountain of life. Tell to that somebody, that's a fountain of life. So whatever you see your perception is or are, it will depend in the how you interpret and discern it with the eye. Hallelujah. So God dealt with the eye. The eye has to be opened first so that they see that they are under now, not above. When they are in the garden, they think like God. They move like God. They see like God. Because they were able to hear God comes in the garden in the cool of the day. But something happened when they eat from the tree of knowledge of good and evil. Their eyes began to see bad. Now they can no longer discern what is good and what is evil. Hallelujah. Turn to your partner. I. Fountain of, e fountain of life now has become the fountain of evil. Now the eyes can kill. Now the eyes recorded evil only, most of the time. You take percentage of the perception if it's like a software or it's like a server, you take it out every day. I wish God would have done that and you just replay the whole picture that the, that, the, that the moving notions that the eye took and stored up in the server, you will be surprised. In a day. Turn to your partner and say, what do you see every day? Is it fountain of life or fountain of evil? Come on somebody, come on somebody, come on somebody. I'm getting there, getting there, getting there, getting there. Tell your partner, I'm getting there. Fountain of life. Shut it out. Fountain of life. Fountain of life. And then they were naked. Naked. Tell your partner, naked. Tell them, naked. Wow. And I was looking at naked and you see, you know naked. You're naked. Bear. Not bear. Bear. No clothes on. No covering. Amen. I heard it from my mentors and they said, no covering, the anointing is gone. Yes. But I was asking the Lord, why is it the anointing left with this nakedness? How did it, le how did it leave them? Yes, they ate. Okay. But where in the body, the part of the body, if you dealt with the five physical senses, where in the body, the part of the five physical senses that went naked? I receive an answer. I receive an answer. This is the answer. You look at me. They were naked in the mind. Nakedness begins in the mind. That's how I receive it from the hearts of prayer. It begins in your consciousness, in your subconsciousness, register your consciousness, and that is how they fell. They began to think like the serpent. They were already in the presence. They begin to think the presence. When I'm releasing the message in the 24-7, they get it instantly. They started looking at me. I can tell in the eyes the joy. I can tell in the eyes the sparkling of the fountain of life in the eyes. And they say, we got it. We got it. Now we got it. Why? Because every time they enter the prayer room, they enter, some of them, they enter with doubt. They enter with fear. They enter with depression and oppression. They enter with hatred. They enter with everything. They load it up when they go to the prayer room and they come back. They are a frustrated prayer warrior. But now they begin to understand that the fall of man when he, when he thinks below the level 
of thinking of God. How does God think in his word? Tell your partner, in his word. Come on, shout it out. In his word. Think according to his word. Think according to his word. Adam! I'm here, my Lord. You be Adam, Grace. Adam! Adam comes in the cool of the day. And I begin conversing, communicating. Adam, what do you think of the world that I created? I have given everything for you. I am now stepping away from your realm because I know you are made in my image. That's the partnership in the cool of the day. But suddenly something happened. Their eyes begin to open. They lose God that they begin to see sin. That is why men will always have this battle in their mind because they are so sin focused now and not God focused. That is why it always takes time to pray because you are so focused on your problem and not the blessings. You are so focused on everything that you think that you know. Your oppressions okay, and not favor. Before when Adam entered the presence of God. Adam, where are you? I'm here, my Lord. He's thinking favor. He's thinking blessing. He's thinking dominion. He's thinking everything. But that defeats the whole purpose. He's naked. Go back. Now, now listen to me. When you sin, it begins here. See, for example, I started, okay? Nisa didn't know that I am the one I'm spreading gossip about him. And all of a sudden, in the corner, in Nandi Taman, I suddenly met him. I cannot just face him. Why? Because I'm naked in here. The picture is nakedness. He's hatred. That's nakedness. Tell to somebody, nakedness is hatred. Unforgiveness is hatred. It's, it's nakedness. Okay, low self-depression of esteem is nakedness. Adam was not wired up to think like that. Now turn to that somebody and said, I believe in Jesus. I have the mind of Jesus. Shout it out. I have the mind of Jesus. I have the mind of Jesus. Eyes, eyes, eyes. Cover your eyes in the blood of Jesus all the time. Come on, somebody. Cover your eyes in the blood of Jesus. Woo! Cover your eyes. Kill the Lord. Cover the blood. Cover the blood. Cover the blood. You need those eyes like fountains of life. Whenever I look at somebody, there's no lust. There's no immorality. There's no adultery. It cannot be recorded here. Why? Because I have changed on the inside. The change comes from the mind. That you no longer have those filthy dreams. You are dreaming dreams. You are seeing vision, God. Now, God is spirit. Stand up, Adam. Okay. God is spirit. How is it that a physical man can see a spiritual God? Listen to me. You know, this is what God showed me. In the prayer, in the 24 7, this is what God showed me. This is a revelation. God, Adam, I'm Adam now, saw God through visions. Dreams. The mind at the time was not corrupted. So everything that God wants, he imparted it in Adam's vision and dreams and ideas. And he think exactly like God. In the end times, I will pour out my spirit. Yes. Young men shall see visions. Your old men shall dream dreams. He is retaining Eden back on earth. Hallelujah. That is why you need to deal with the eye. Hallelujah. If you click on the eyes, 
The Hebrew word is Ain. Ain, fountain of living water. Hallelujah. Fountain of life. It's in your eyes. So all these beautiful eyes looking at me, I can see waterfalls. Mm -hmm. Why? Because your eyes is most important to God. How did Adam met God? Knows when he's coming in the cool of the day. Visions. Eva, just hold on. Elohim powers is walking among the garden. I know. Eve asked for the first time. How did he know my, my husband? I know. I can see him in my vision. How did Adam just woke up and saw Eve? God said he caused a deeper, come on, sleep. Ask your person, ask the person to you, do you sleep? What kind of dreams you're dreaming? If it's filthy, it's just kind of, and everything, something is wrong with you, you must be cursed. Get out from the curse. So that God can clarify everything to you. God is restoring. He's saying, I am about to go now, but I am pouring my spirit. I am retaining what's lost in the garden. Now you can walk with power. It is just that that God, that Adam wants to tell, that Satan wants to take up. It's the power of communication with God through dreams and visions. God is restoring. You know what happened in the future of prayer? The 24 7. They smiled. And when we worship, it's just an acoustic guitar. And Sam just picked up the guitar and they said, What a beautiful name. And you hear all those 84 year old grandmother, you know, the 60 year old grandfather. They just know the chorus. And they said, What a beautiful thing this. They sing it like a slant in Drake and White. Drake and White slang, easily slang. And they started singing. Oh, on top of their voices. Why? Now they know power. It's been released. It was taken from the garden. God said in Luke 10, I have given you exorcia. Tell a partner, partner, I'm back. Come on, the devil better not mess around with me. Come on, somebody. The devil better not mess around with me. Sit down. Hallelujah. 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 Now put up your hands if you if you receive. If you know what I'm talking about. Be honest. Be honest. You and me live in the physical plane. God is spirit. He only talks to you through dreams and visions. That's a communication line in God. In heaven. In Eden. Back then. Communication one on one. Commune one on one with, with Adam. Adam dreamt from the night that this is what God wants. He just woke up and said, Honey, let's go hunting. And when they came in and said, they point up in the sky, they said, Do you know, honey, that's a minor bird. That's a giraffe. That's an elephant. There's a wild boar. That fish is called a guitar. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Receive, 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 receive. Hey, it's like that. You wake up in the morning. Come on, Daddy. You, come on, Daddy. You wake up in the morning. Hold your hands, wife. Oh, you can come down. Jump. Okay, hold your hand. And they said, come on, darling. We're going out. Okay, where? In the, in, the, in the heart of prayer. In the presence of God. Let's call out. Giraffe. Come on. Elephant. We're calling out. Elephant. Fishes. Get lower. Get the whales. Come in. Come in. Come in. I'm calling out breakthrough, 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 breakthrough. Coming in, sales, this and that. We'll mark it. We'll go in. We'll uh, come on because you think like God. God is in here. Bang, 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 bang.
That is not the vocabulary in the garden. Who told you they were naked? Did you eat from the tree that I told you not to eat? That tree is not the tree. You know why it's called the tree in the Bible? Because God has already planted the garden. And in the tree there are fruits. And in the fruits there are seed. And in the seed contains a tree and contains a forest. Amen? So whatever decision they did that time, it will have a ripple effect on humanity. Just like the cycle of a tree. The sin became a great forest on generations and generations to come. Hallelujah. Tell your papa, who said that you were naked? Who said that you were naked? If you're a man sitting here and you're lustfully looking at a, at a, at a woman, you're naked. Come on, come on. Admiring is different, but the second look, the third look, you commit adultery. That's nakedness. And when you speak, you cannot look eye in eye. Why? You mandua because you have some sort of negative force within you that yearns. Come on. That's not how God created Adam. It was freshness. It was so deep, beyond fathom, beyond description. When the Adam, where are you? I am here, my Lord. Now we are ashamed because we are naked. We come to God naked because what we do out of nakedness, they lift out the anointing from our lives. You are naked in here, my friend. Tell your partner. Nakedness, it begins in the mind. Come on, nakedness begins in the mind. Woo -hoo -hoo. Give a big shout to the Lord. Now, pray to let somebody stand with him or her. Let's pray together. Come on. Pray together. Stand. Pray together. Pray together for that fresh revelation. Nakedness begins in the mind. When you think below, not above. Come on. Pray, pray. Just two, just two. No let one must wonder. That's effective. That's effective. Effective. Pray together. Turn to us each other. Hold both hands and pray. Declare, declare, pray atoms. Don't pray small prayers. Pray, change the vocabulary of your prayer. Command and decree. Don't back. Kings don't back. They decree. Decree, decree, decree and declare that my partner, that my friend is coming out of all that in the name of Jesus. Coming out of the cunningness, the slyness. Come on! After that, release power. <laughs> Decree, cut in the name of Jesus. That is why we do atomic prayers now. We break all generational curses. Decree, declare, decree, declare. name we pray. Amen. Amen. Now give a big clap offering. And go. I'm working in power. Come on. Move back and forth. 
in the name of Jesus. Just begin to move across. Just begin to move across. That's somebody you don't have never touched before in prayer anymore. When I'm talking about the children, it begins in my family. My two children, my daughter and my son. And it flows out to the network within the video of prayer. God is holy. God is holy. Now just rise up after hearing that news. Just rise up the revelation. Just rise up with thanksgiving in your heart. Come on, stand up. Now I need you to move out, to move around with a fountain of life perspective. Can you do that? And pray for that somebody. Now move. Now move. Just pray. Five minutes, pray. Then you move. Five minutes, then you pray. Hallelujah. Come on, people. Pray. Fountain of life.
Thank you, Jesus. 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 how he is able, Adam is able to do God's will, God's will, God's will, communing one to one. So if vision is, is what God gave Adam, then the greatest gift that God gave Adam is not the gift of sight. It is a gift of vision. Turn to your partner's head. So the greatest gift that God gave Adam it's not the gift of sight. It's a gift of vision. Tell us somebody, vision, vision, vision. Shut it out, vision. Come on, tell your partner, preach, preach. Now, repeat after me, preach, repeat after me. Okay? For your eyes is the function of your sight. Or sight is the function of the eye. Come on, somebody, sight is the function of the eye. Vision is a function of the heart. So whenever God said, Adam, I love you, it comes from the heart. Adam, I chose you, it comes from the heart. Adam, your descendant, numerous as the stars and the sand of the seashores, it comes from the heart, it can never be changed. For God honors his word about you, more about your word. Because when you deal with God, it's from the heart to heart. You can change your mind because of you function in your eyes. But for God, it functions in the heart. Hallelujah. For out of the heart upon visions. Tell it somebody. God is back in your house. Because he is giving you dreams and visions. Same pattern in the Garden of Eden. What more? What more? If your son is rebelling, pray. Seek Yahweh. He will give you vision and you will straighten him. Are you watching porno? Why? Because in the night, I was praying, God, so much purity, this spirit is coming in. That's how God and Adam operate in the garden. Do not say it's just a kind of little prayer. You have been praying, vision or dream. Move in. 
Sometimes I've moved in and said, give me your mobile phones. How is it that a child, a teenager can lie in the dark for six hours with no lights on, but you see the lights mobile? Who sees mobile in the dark of the night? Darkness. To the bottom. And when they fell, and when they fell, and when they fell, they fall, they deep fall. Listen to me. They fall here. They think below. Let's fall. When you just think below, that's fall. That's falling. That's sin. You miss the mark. And this is what they did. This is what they did. They shoot together. Two, three. And they gather fig leaves together and made themselves. Oh. I was asking the Lord. Well, really, really um, uh, uh, naked? If you're telling me it's in the mind, what's that nakedness? How is it that they're going to clothe it? You know how they clothe it, those fig leaves? It's religion. Religion is the fig leaves. People all over Fiji, now we're having church service all over Fiji. There are people who are entertaining sin. They walk in and they walk out. Undetected. From where? From up here. Hello? They move it out. It's just like a club. Hello? That's the feet leaves. Put on. Good faces, right words, right clothing, right friends. But really, there's nakedness in that man. You cannot play God, for God will one day expose that nakedness. He said, build me an altar. But never ever build steps up, for I will expose your nakedness. I will expose, in other words, one day I will expose what's in here. You're going to leave that, what's in there, and I'll expose it without you in knowing you for this normal. Turn to that somebody, I hate silence. You need to cry. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Fig leaf is religion. It is man-made. Adam made. Hey, now Timu, just look for any tree. Luckily, there's no weird tree there. Or oh, weird leaves. When God comes in, they are you all the way. Amen. But no, they choose fig trees. Fig leaves, fig leaves. Come on in here. Ah, good works in religion. Okay? By giving everything, but inside it's so dirty with garbage. And God said, ah, ha, ha, ha. Adam, Adam, who told you they were naked? Who told you? I made you and I give you freedom from, from choices and will, make willpower and change. But I never said you were naked. Religion. Tell that somebody. Religion. 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 Is fig leaves. Because it's born out of a tree. It's not from God. Spirit Elohim powers. Cool of the day. He, he is the breath of God. I breathe and I have breath. Is in the presence. Of the garden. He can hear in his mind, imagination, even powers. Yes, breathe, breathe. What do you want? That communication no longer exists when there's nakedness, there's a religion covering that sin. That is why you don't have to cover. You cannot cover in here. God will expose you one day. So it's better you come close to God. For God loves you. When God said he loves you, it's from deep within. Not you. Hallelujah. Tell that somebody. Man and woman or human being. Come on. When they love, it's just in part. For God, he loves you in this life. 
life to come. He offers you eternal life. Wow. You jump in the boat, get in my insurance, you're covered here on earth. And after that, I'll market you. I'll put you out in the You can mention everything up there in heaven. It's ready for you. So now walk. Do think like me when you're operating. Hallelujah. Mommy. Turn to that somebody and say, For sight is the function of the eyes. These eyes that were open, they no longer see visions, they see darkness. The visions change. It's not the eyes, the vision change. That's nakedness. They begin to see things, demonic, demonic induced thought patterns, build up strongholds of the mind, began to be erected because of unmet needs, un un unfulfilled, unfulfilled needs, unful unmet, 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 everything is unmet, 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 unmet. Things in your life that are being unmet, it lays, broken, it lays those big strongholds in the mind. It's bricked it up, it's bricked up, it's bricked up. It needs to change, it needs to change because God is resurrecting you. I believe in God, in Jesus, and the resurrection power. It has to begin here before you demonstrate it in the dunamis. Hallelujah. When God said, Adam, I'm going to make the whole world like Eden. He saw in the vision. And the never vision never went away from him. Until it was corrupted. Hey, when this picture gone to, I lost it. There's nakedness. I lost it. I lost it. You need to get back to your first love. I lost it. I want to pray. There's no fire. I want to read. There's no fire. There's nothing. There's no urgent. There's, there was this that joy in running to fellowship. It's gone. Something is wrong. You are getting naked. This bear all over. You need back. God, visions, dreams, it has to be retained now. In Jesus' name. I stand, I stand in glory. I stand, I stand. In the garden. I hear you, Lord. You are in the garden. You click on that number. It is a fenced garden. Not an open garden in the village. It's fenced. Tell somebody, it's fenced. Man, how God protected that garden. It's fenced. How he fell. There was a corruption within. Satan went run deep within. And the image of the Almighty planted the seed to corrupt the whole plan of God. Hallelujah. Okay? It was fenced. It was guarded. But listen, afraid because I was naked and I hide. Tell it somebody, hide. When you fell in here, you will hide. <laughs> Tell that somebody, when you fall in your mind, you will hide. This is how you hide. But to suddenly, the are rich well. Are they coming? <laughs> in church, my brother, and my sister, I'm pulling me like, how are you? Oh, praise the Lord. We are doing good and great. No, <laughs> Tell a partner, that's religion. That's religion. Come on, somebody. Build a but that's religion. Come on, say it like me. Build a but that's religion. You will receive no power from that. That is why when the high priest will come on and book back and forth, declare, focus on the blessing and not the problem, Be back and forth, declare favor and power, always in the presence. They are speaking God's language in the presence in the tabernacle. Woo. 
we do the opposite. We bring in the tabernacle, curse and bitterly and hatred, confusion. That's what Adam was doing because they, they cannot confess because of religion. Religion is title, experience. Oh man. Tell a partner how long? Mm. Tell a partner how long? How long? How long? Don't Religion. Get out. Get out of the fig leaves. Get out of the fig leaves. Trevor is listening. Get out. Get away from the fig leaves. Get away from the fig tree. You are not meant to be in the fig leaves mentality and mindset. Some of you are receiving miracles, but on the fig trees of the fig leaves level. Come on. Come on. You need to move. You need to move. You need to move. The voice of the Lord. 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 God is speaking. The voice of the Lord. Amen. Amen. They hid themselves. And who told you? You are naked. Who told you you are naked? 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 So next week, when people come in, they are coming in fully dressed. Amen. Come in fully dressed. Your mind and everything. When you walk in a prayer meeting, come in fully dressed. Come on, somebody. Amen. Are you dressed up in your mind? Walking like a boss, walking like a king. Amen. You come in on Monday, you kick the door and you come in. Here is the boss coming in the house. Amen. Come on, kick the door and just walk in. Listen, nobody mess around with me this week. Because I walk with him. I talk like him. I think like him. Imitate your daddy God. Hallelujah. Amen. Your employer or your boss in your workplace is just up there temporarily. Tell them about it, temporarily. But the one who sent me outlived the temporary boss. So I work for him. I don't work for him, for my temporary boss. Why? Because I operate in revelation. I operate in vision. I operate in dreams. And I. Woo. in the house of prayer and I get the pattern. Watch this. Watch this. This is the pattern. Let's read that. Two, three. And the said you shall not and when the woman the tree four and that it was pleasant eyes and the tree to be desired to make one wise she took and did and gave unto her and he did mm. and that's how they sinned i got the pattern for them you know the pattern is it volunteers now we like to your name dr god i breathe and i breath they, stand there Grace, stand up. <laughs> Elijah, you stand up now because you're a God. You better. You're human being. Now, everybody repeat over me. And the shepherd, this is the shepherd. And the shepherd. Okay? Talk to the woman. Everybody said, this is the woman. Come on, this is the woman. And that is Adam, the husband. Come on. That's Adam, the husband. Now repeat after me. There is the shepherd. Grace is uh, woman. woman. And Elijah is Adam. So Adam, Eve, shepherd. Adam, Eve, devil. Adam, Eve, Satan. This is a pattern so easy. Now Satan comes along and plant a seed, a thought. Grace, do you know? You don't know this, eh? Oh, man. You mean, oh, no, you did not know? You know, guess I always talk behind your back. <laughs> huh? But well, you never know. You stay with her, you move around with her. You thought you're best friend, but no. I, I, I know, I know. You know who told me? And then you say, man, I couldn't believe. And then while taking that 
Jesus said, see, he did not filter the thoughts. She's a prayer warrior. She just came out from a closet, talking with her daddy God. That night, she had an awesome time. Your know, God downloaded dreams and poems and words. And during the 12 hour time, the, the devil comes in and worship her. Now what happened? That thought, he'll become, she'll become restless with it. And she'll find somebody. The only one to turn to was the husband. Come on. Then, she spoke to the husband. And the husband said, what? What? We feed her, we give her money, we support her, we have everything. What? What is it? Never mind, we cut it off. We just get it. I, I don't care. I don't care. This, this can be fixed. But they didn't know that they got fell. Now, where's the devil? Is the devil in the household? He's far away. <laughs> he just planted the seed in the house. <laughs> now, every time that there is this type of sin, you, you, you will find, you look for your husband. You have your husbands in here. I'm not talking about your physical husband, your spiritual physical wife. You have your husband, he's been, he's been, he's been, he's been. The one you are close to, you can share secrets, that's your husband. Now it's time to divorce. Hallelujah. It's time to divorce. That's the pattern. It was in the Bible. Satan will use another Satan. Say for example, day is in a bottle of nothing. Okay? And then the wind, evil wind, came in and said, but grace. Now, there is a physical person. Now, it's no longer Satan. I'm Satan now. Then he'll walk this week, next week, fourth week, until he befriends grace. And then all of a sudden, what? <laughs> then he will look for the husband. Come on. So there's three, what's up, in the church and in the ministry, when they come in for prayer, they still, what? Hallelujah. Turn to your partner, there's no, wow. Okay? It's all about him. That's how it comes in. That's why when you walk in, there are thoughts that penetrate your mind, that pierce your mind, the shield of your mind, everything. You see, Eden was protected. Where was Eden? Eden was here. Adam and Eve. And it was fully fenced, protected until there's a penetrating a virus went down deep within. Cut off that place. And they fell. Turn to your partner and say, just put your hands up if you get it. Hallelujah. That's how it is. It comes, begins with a thought. A thought. Who planted the seed? You can know. You have been given the power. See them. This is a power. Now, let's read that. Two, three. And I, and he said, two, three. Can you shut it out? Can you shut it out? Again. them Jesus Yeshua the three Trinity the Father the Son and the Holy Ghost the Son was present from the beginning and he now told his disciple when they came back rejoicing and they said must even the devil and Satan obey us when we command them in your name and say Jesus just look at them hush 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 it's okay I saw that unemployed child fell from heaven. I was there. He was roaming around. I was there. I, I was there. I saw it all along. But now I'm here on earth. Come on, somebody. He's here on earth. And he has given power. He has given power. He has given power. Amen. 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 
He was telling his disciples, don't worry. I saw him running around in heaven. Don't worry. Worry my God. Amen. Don't worry. Still about him. No worries. I saw him from heaven. He fell. You know how he fell? Blink of the eye. My father, Teddy God, just says, even though I breathe, he just, what did he see? My father in the throne room in heaven discerned his thought. And he said, he was singing his thought. And it's in Isaiah. I will ascend much higher than the throne of God. I will. The five I wills, that's what the Bible says. The five I wills. As soon as he's done with the five I wills, and God said, get out from my presence, Lucifer. You tell your partner, he's just a noun. Satan is just a noun. Tell to your partner, Satan is just a noun. <laughs> Hallelujah. 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 That's my right, stuff.
open. They fell from grace, but now God is restoring. I have given you power. 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 Yes, Lord, the power, the power on high, the power on high, the power of God, the power of His Word. Arise and shine, for thy light has come. The glory of the Lord has risen upon you. For behold, the darkness shall cover the earth, and cross darkness, and the people of the Lord shall arise upon thee. And his glory shall be seen unto thee. The Gentiles shall come to your light. The kings and the brightness of thy rising. Lift up your eyes around and about. See all they gather themselves together. They come to you. The sons, your sons shall come from afar. You will have daughters and they will be nursed by your side. And thou shalt see and flow together from thy heart and fear and be enlarged because of the abundance of the sea shall be converted unto thee the abundance of the sea shall be converted unto thee the forces of Gentiles shall come upon thee the multitudes of camels and cover thee the dromedaries of Midian and Ephah they are from Sheba they shall bring forth gold and incense and they shall shew forth the praises of the Lord Hallelujah. Your gates shall be open day and night, continually. Wealth and riches will come in and out, go in and out. Trade. Yes, right now, in Jesus' name. Trade. Somebody receive that in Jesus' name. It will be a victorious week. It will be a week of open doors. When God opened rivers in our places. God has opened rivers in our places. God has restored power. Power. Rivers in the heavenlies. It has been restored to the right thinking, the right mindset, the right attitude. And it will fall upon it in Jesus' name. Let those eyes be the eyes of living water. The eyes of life. I declare and I decree in Jesus' name. When they no longer see mountains, they see molehills. When they no longer see giants, uh, they see they see level playing field in Jesus' name. Where their seas are crossables, where their red seas are crossables, and every door is an openable in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Their giants are slainable because they are walking in a different mindset. The mindset of a garden of Eden, where they walk with the Lord, where they move with the healing powers, they move with the power of Elohim. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, they shall move, they shall dwell, they shall move, and they shall dwell. They will not visit your presence. They will dwell in your presence because there's an anointing. There is a promise for those who dwell, not visit. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, for the shadow of the Almighty, yes, Lord, who dwell in the shadow, in the shadow, in the shadow, in Jesus' name. Father God, thank you so much. From everlasting to everlasting, thou art God. Thank you for the power of vision, power of vision, 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 revelation, gift, O oh God. We have our skills with us. We learn it from schools and from universities. The nation and people hire us for our skills. But Father, we are cutting edge, we are catalysts in our, in our workplaces. Because now we function with the vision. For the vision is the function of art. Not skills. The function of art. This is high plane, high level. Because our mission is not just to build churches, not to build buildings. We don't invest in buildings. We don't invest in buildings. We don't invest in things. We invest in people. Because the people are you image on earth. That is why you loved our teenagers so much. You love our four, four flag family so much. That you expose about this message. This vibers. Lord, you love them so much. May our relationship not fit trees full of lies and deceits. Full of fakeness and fraudulent. May it be open with open rivers. 
fountains of life. Open the river, Father. We want to dwell in it. There's a river. There is just let it in
favor is you, Jesus Christ. We no longer live in regrets and fear. We thank you, Jesus. And is 3, 7, 8, 9. That's in the book of Luke. Now I'm going to take you up. The shopping in Genesis 3, 4 is 5, 1, 7, 5. That's the one I was reading. Cunningness, divination, no more vision, and you bring chaos and calamity. Amen? If you operate below, you can also have dreams, but it's from the devil. Now, this shepherd, there's a, I have given you Power on shepherds, power to turn on shepherds. Now those shepherds, if you if you click on that shepherds in Luke chapter ten verse nineteen, it is you have taken out the power of the hish. Okay, his his h i s s. That's how the shepherd operates. You took out the power of hish. You take it out. You know what's happening to you now? God has given you the ability to make dunamis, operating dunamis and exosia. It's simply this, the sharpness in discernment. Sharpness in discernment. Those discernment that they come from the function of the eyes. They come from the function of the heart. The heart tells you not to go to Suwa. You stay. You block out the... The 
function the spirit says this but you see the weather okay we still can cross don't cross because he that man or that woman is operating on a higher level communion with god because if you go otherwise <coughs> the shepherd will bite you Father, there's more to share, but our time is caught up with us. Thank you for the atomic prayers that were sent today. Atomic energies were released all over in Nandi, in the nation as a whole. Father, we thank you for the miracle molecules that are operating everywhere around this nation. And only those atoms, Lord, they are nucleus. And those nucleus, there are electrons and the protons that are operating, oh God. Thank you, Father. Spiritually, Lord, you are moving the atoms around. Spiritual atoms around in this nation. Move. Make. Send your angels. Make. Create. Do something new. For your word says, I am, I am doing something new. Thank you so much. In our lives, radical change in our life. Radical transformation in our life. And we thank you and we love you. This is our prayer. In Jesus' wonderful name we pray. Amen. 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 Everybody shout amen. Amen. Now, that's the end of our prayer today. Thank you so much for coming. Give a big hand to the Lord. And for those who are joining us live stream, I hope you're blessed. Thank you for connecting with us live as we share and as we pray. Thank you for praying for Fiji. And thank you for praying for the nation. Thank you for praying for the islands, nations, and the Pacific and also we are enlarging our territories in our prayers and teams are moving around the nation They are praying and our friends in Wittilebu and Gunolebu Thank you so much for connecting and those who are at home in your living room and Wherever you are. Thank you so much. God bless you. We'll see you next week. Amen